And welcome back to Ozarks Live. We're in Wheatland. We are at the Lucas Oil Speedway because the Mid-America Outdoor Off-Road event is two days <laughs> of big time racing. That's right, that's yeah, right. And it's starting today. We have one of the drivers here, CJ Greaves. Good to see you, first of all. Thanks Good for being with us. <laughs> okay, reading up on you, you've been doing this since like you were just like a little kid. Yeah, I've been doing it. I've been racing professionally for uh, 12 years now, going in 13 years, and I'm 27 years old and uh, just love racing. I uh, grew up in it. My dad's uh, Johnny Greaves. Most people know him from short course racing, one of the winningest drivers in short course history. So yeah. this is my first time here out in Wheatland. I'm excited to be here. And uh, for me, it's my first time here. Uh, I've been racing the Midwest for a couple of years now, and and I'm glad to finally be able to make the trip and get out here and check this track out. Yeah, you know, sure. and talking about your dad being a champion and really making a name, from what I understand, you're kind of making your name as well. I, I see that you've been up on a podium an awful lot in your career. Yeah, I've been doing my best, man. Uh, yeah. We got a couple championships, uh, eight in Pro 4 now, um, three in Pro 2, a handful of UTV ones. We run for Factory Polaris in the UTV, and a uh, couple in a buggy. So. We've been doing our best, learning from the best, and uh, now we're ready to kind of go in a throwback. Um, it's been 10 years since I've competitively raced a pro light truck, but I'm right. excited to be here with uh, uh, here at Wheatland with all the Mid-America crew um, and everyone involved there. I'm super excited to be here. Yeah, for sure. Now, what are you most excited for when it comes to the race? Because I understand there might be some other family members you're racing against. Yeah, absolutely. So most people know against my dad and I racing against each other all the time. And that's, that's usually the way it's been growing up. And uh, my cousin is also here running a pro light, and he is the defending pro light champ. And we've never got to race against each other in a truck. So this will be the first this weekend. The first. This is the first weekend we've ever got to race against each other in trucks. And uh, it's super excited. Um, I, last year in uh, 2022, he was the champ. And I was actually uh, spotting for him all year. So now, right. now, now we go back back and forth a little bit and um, his brother Corey is going to be spotting for him and uh, I was the spotter and now I'm going to be racing against him and uh, okay, we're is, have is some this, fun. Is this like many families, my, myself included, yeah the prize money and stuff, the trophy is great, the bragging rights is what does it. <laughs> oh man, I mean it, it's yeah. all family fun. We like we like to be able to go back and all have fun and, and, and talk smack to each other but we like to, to race hard and race fun and, and really put on a show. I mean, that's what it really comes down to. All these people that take time out of their day, take their hard-earned money to come here and watch us have a little bit of fun in our trucks is, is what it's all about. So yeah. we come out here to, to put on a show and do the best we can. Yeah, absolutely. Now, you've talked about how long you've been doing this. So what continues to draw you back in year after year, season after season? Oh, you know, I mean, um, I, I don't even know how to answer that. It, it is <laughs> The minute you step foot in in a, in a side by side and you get out on a dirt track, it's something that you can never you never get to experience again. It's like riding on a roller coaster that just has no rails or nothing, and you get to point it wherever you want to go and, and and do whatever you want with it. So the thrill, the adrenaline of of getting out there on the track and bumping doors with friends, rivals, family, and and it just trickles down and then. Even here um, at Mid America in Wheatland, they have a ton of kids. There's there you get to come here, watch the 170s, yeah. see the all the kids doing racing out there as well. And I enjoy watching them as much as I do getting out on the track. Now, you've done the buggies, you've done uh, the pro lights, you've done pro two and four. Yeah. Do you have a favorite out of it? And I mean, I know, that, I know that's like asking who's your favorite kid, <laughs> but do you have a favorite out of those? Oh, you know, they each are the, like their own little niche, right? Yeah. Um, go, going the, the Pro Light and Pro 2, both being two-wheel drive, more of a spec chassis. Um, I enjoy running them. Like when I had the opportunity to get back in this Pro Light, um, it just so happens to be one of our sponsors had one sitting there. It was like, you want to run it this weekend? And I'm like, I'll, I'll give it my best. It's been <laughs> 10 years, but we'll see if we can knock some of the rust off and get out yeah, there and have fun. Yeah, but okay. when it really comes a down to man too, right, right? Hey, we do our <laughs> best. But when it really comes down to getting out there, I mean, you can't beat a Pro 4. 900 yeah. horsepower, revving right next to you, four-wheel drive digging, uh, just bearing you in the seat is something that you can never yeah. replace, man. Yeah. Now, on that note, is there any, like, preparation you do before the season starts, maybe uh, just to get better each season? Yeah, I mean, we, we just continue to try to grow as a team, as a family, continue to grow and, and just do better, whether, whether it matters of getting out and practicing it more or um, being a little bit more particular with tires or testing tire pressure, just little things that, that may go a long ways. Um, we, we always continue to try to strive to do better because at any given moment, 
when, when you decide that you're good enough, the next guy's going to blow your door off and show you that you're not. So <laughs> There's gotta, always someone waiting right yes. behind you. There's always someone yes. there. So you got to make sure you stay on top of your game and just continue to dig forward. All right, very cool. Well, CJ, this has been such a pleasure. Good luck this weekend as yes. you're racing. Yeah. I appreciate Good meeting it. you. Hope you beat you your cousin. Well. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Everyone watching, make sure you come out here and uh, check it out. We're here for two days. Yeah, the, as CJ the said. The champions are out. They yes. really are. Yes. Come Thanks, check CJ. out Lucas Oil Speedway and Ozark Slide. We'll be right back. <laughs>